Hello, everybody, and welcome. This is Adrian. Thank you so much for joining me today. It's going to be time for some Age of Empires Definitive Edition. So, it's been a long time since I've uh, played our Let's Play of Age of Empires Definitive Edition, but we're going to be continuing on. This is the Glory of Greece campaign. I do hope to do more with, uh, with Age of Empires. <clears throat> Excuse me, I have a little bit of a cold, so you'll have to forgive my, uh, my coughing. But uh, anyway, we were on the mission, um, the Siege of Athens. This is the sixth mission in this campaign. I'm not actually sure how many missions there are, but it should be fun. So let's go ahead and go on to a little bit of the backstory of uh, what's going on. We're in Athens in 405 BC. Over the past several centuries, the Greek city-states have expanded their influence both in Hellas and overseas. Now, a powerful coalition led by the dual monarchy of Sparta is challenging your city-state of Athens for dominance in a conflict that has lasted three decades. In the wake of the disastrous Sicilian expedition, Sparta has seized the initiative, claiming several key victories and drawing ever closer to Athens. You have no hope of defeating the battle-hardened Spartans in the field at present, but there is a chance that you may be able to defend the city long enough for reinforcements and supplies to arrive and turn the tide in your favor. The Spartan army is reliant on a large baggage train of supplies. If it is captured, their siege will be delayed considerably. Cool. All right. <clears throat> so we have to capture the Spartan baggage train, which was represented by four artifacts. And let's take out some of the hints. <clears throat> Excuse me. Spartan army is upon us. Hurry. Get all your villagers within the city walls of Athens before it's too late. Maintain the strength of all of our fortifications. And then send villagers to nearby islands to seek resources required to support your army. Cool. Let's take a little bit of the history. By the 5th century BCE, the region of Hellas, as the Greeks called modern-day Greece, was dominated by a number of several powerful city-states such as Athens, Sparta, Thebes, and Corinth. These city-states tended to compete with each other economically, militarily, and culturally, but were briefly galvanized by a pair of dangerous invasions conducted by the Achaemenids. This period was termed as the Persian Wars and yielded some of the most... Popular narratives to come out of the classical era, such as the heroic but doomed defense of the coastal passage of Thermopylae by King Leonidas of Sparta and his 300 warriors. And then basically, um, Athens would become a leader of the Delian League, which was a thalassocracy of city-states and territories that encompassed much, uh, encompassed much of the Aegean. And Sparta, on the other hand, would form the Peloponnesian League, a formidable land-based power built on a slave economy and rigorous military training. Eventually, this would... Um, devolve into the Peloponnesian War, which what we're fighting, which is what we're fighting right now, and Sparta would win that war. But would later be defeated by Thebes, and then Thebes would later be defeated by Macedon. And that would be under King Philip II. <clears throat> and later Alexander would take power. Alright, let's jump on it. It's been a while since I played Age of Empires, so you might have to forgive my skills, I'm probably gonna suck. Holy shit. Whoa! Damn, Spartans are coming after us. Okay. Let's get everybody inside. Let's see, how many troops do I have? Alright. Gnarly, okay. So, let's take a look here. So we have a lot of villagers. We were able to save all of our villagers, which is good. Make sure everybody can get inside first. Come on, peeps. Okay. Got some fishing boats here. Got a couple of transports. Okay. So we have a we have a fairly large army actually. I'm not sure if we can necessarily protect the farms though. Ooh, there's a Spartan Navy. We're in the Iron Age already, so it looks like we just need to worry about resources, not necessarily technology. So that's cool. <clears throat> okay. Uh let's see, where is our town center? Perhaps we don't have one. So we have some cataphracts. We have uh, these centurions here. So 
that's cool. <laughs> okay. Oh damn. Alright. Let's keep the archers in the back. Cool. These ballista towers should make short work of most of these guys. We got a couple triremes. Let's explore a little bit. So the Spartan army's in red, the Spartan navy's in yellow. We have the Theban army. Uh, yeah, so we're at war with Thebes as well. <clears throat> so we have quite a few uh, uh, enemies. That's not good. I I don't actually think, I don't know if we have a town center, do we? We have a market. So we don't have a town center, okay. So we'll need to go to another neighboring island, get some resources. These guys are probably going to destroy most of this, but at least Athens itself is fortified. So that's cool. So let's see if we can, see if we can explore around here. We need gold for sure. We have um, not a lot of stone either. We could use more. This isn't a very large map though, so... <clears throat> the towers and the infantry should be able to keep people off our back for the most part. Holy shit! <clears throat> Jesus. Okay, so at least we know where the Spartans are. Damn. We have a few fishing boats. We can get some juggernauts if we wanted to. Let's get a couple fishing boats, I think. Just make sure we can get some food coming in. How was that? Is that a monk? Okay. Hmm. There. Let me fish around here. Let's go for that. Let's so we have a transport here. We could transfer some infantry and villagers somewhere, although. The Spartans are throwing quite a few troops over here in my, um, <clears throat> in my walled city, so... Don't know how I feel about that. Yeah, I may want to convert one of these guys and see what we can do. Let's get these villagers out of here. Bushes or anything in here? Any gold mines? Nope. Okay. Jesus Christ. Looks like we were attacked by another trireme somewhere. Okay, so converting people is going to be pretty smart for us right now. Converting some of these guys. We convert pretty fast. And then healing with the, um, with the priest is also going to be necessary. Okay. The question is, where is this baggage train? Oh, shit! We got siege weapons. Fuck. Can I convert one of those guys? 
Jesus. Fuck. No. You have to kill his catapults. Oh, God. Run, people. Holy crap. That's a lot of troops. That's uh that's a lot of troops. Okay. <clears throat> So I've lost all my troops. Um, can we go to the... Let's see. Do you have an academy? Yeah, uh, I got an archer range. Don't have an academy. Do you have a town center? There's my town center. Oh, I knew I had one somewhere. I don't have an academy. I don't think I do anyway. I don't see an academy here. Building one right here would probably be pretty smart. I don't have a gold though to, to get troops anyway, so I'm not sure if it matters. Shit. We have stone here. There's stone on this little island right here, so let me let me get some workers for that. <clears throat> How much are juggernauts? We have a lot of wood, so we can afford to get some juggernauts, I think. Or some triremes. <clears throat> and then the woodcutters will be able to supply our our wood needs. Yeah, let's get some of the stone real fast, and then I think we'll get some gold from somewhere, possibly. I'm not entirely sure where these, um, where these artifacts are, though. I'm imagining they're somewhere here because we have roads, so... There's some sort of military force out here somewhere. I don't know where. We don't have the troops, though, to really go find out. Not yet, anyway. Quite a few ships are here. Let's get some stone just in case we have to build more towers and things like that. We'll have some we'll have some stone to be able to work with. I need gold though. That's kind of a big deal. I don't know what's over here. I could try and explore, but I can't really get too close probably. <laughs> it's kinda of cool though, kind of an interesting mission. Looks like the Spartans of um Kind of let off a little bit. So that's good. This kind of makes me want to play Total War Rome 2. The, um... Whoa. That's weird. Makes me want to play Total War Rome 2. With the uh, Wrath of the Sparta campaign. <laughs> I really should. I actually... I mean, that was that was one of the first Let's Play campaigns I ever did. Was the Wrath of the Sparta campaign. Way back in 2016. Oh, there we go. We got gold here. Although we have a few Spartan ships. Unfortunately. I hope I don't have to have a military escort over here. I would really prefer not to. I don't think I do need one. Let me build an academy, I think. Um, we will grab a few more archers, probably. I'm gonna see if I can get some cataphracts. We need a gold for that one, though. 
Okay. I'm I'm wondering here if um, what is over here. Looks like we just killed somebody there. Got farms out here. So we have a, we have plenty of uh, stone, plenty of food, pretty decent amount of wood. All right, let's go grab that. We need that gold. We need that gold. So the Spartans have to be somewhere out here for sure. What's over here? Build the tower real fast. Maybe the, maybe the artifacts over here. Holy shit! These ballista towers do twenty damage. Wow, that's quite a bit. <clears throat> so these guys are forty-eight food, thirty-two gold. That's not bad. How much cataphracts? Cataphracts are 70 food, 80 gold. That's quite a bit. Um, let's get more archers. I'm not going to go for the short swords, but I'm going to go for the um, for the centurions. I think they're better. They're better overall troops. We have the axemen. They do 9 damage. They have 6 armor, 3 pierce, or 3 resistance to uh, pierce. But these centurions are just all around better. And uh, they're not even that expensive. Son of a bitch. I'm wondering if I can grab a few juggernauts. I want to see if I can grab some juggernauts. And let me see. They're a little expensive, but let me let me try and grab like three juggernauts. I want to see if I can destroy this base before we um, push out from Athens. I gotta find out what else is going on over here. Three juggernauts should do the job. Damn, those guys are beast. Oh, that's right. They have the, um... I think they have the catapult, right? That's what they call juggernauts? I think so. so. These guys have 14 armor, 3 pierce to... Or 3 armor to, um, arrows. 34 damage. Yeah, there we go. So it's an it's an hour uh, it's an area of effect. Attack. Beast. Let's see what we're gonna find. Check that out. Gnarly. Dude, these juggernauts are beast. Wow. Not bad at all. Okay. So the Spartans were attacking piecemeal. Not anymore, though. They're really kind of done. It's not a bad force that we have right here. It's pretty decent. So...
get gold out here. We're getting some gold here. Okay. We have a, we have a lot of archers. We got a pretty decent amount of centurions as well. Um, I'm hoping they don't bring any siege weapons against me though. That's gonna be annoying. There has to be something here. Town center there. Oh shit. Oh shit. Holy shit. Whoa, that is an enormous army. Oh my god. The demons, holy god. Little bastards. Yeah, we're gonna lose this engagement. Holy shit. Those are heavy cavalry. Centurions do pretty good though. Dude, that's a major army. All right, so we have, we have an artifact there for sure. Okay. So, let's focus on cataphracts because they have artillery weapons. Uh, I don't have a workshop myself. I don't have a siege workshop, but. Okay, so you guys are done. I'm imagining I'm going to find Spartans out here somewhere, so I think we're going to hold off. Damn it, how the hell did I lose a Juggernaut? That's weird. Okay, let me check. Is there any sort of... artifact over here? I don't see one. Okay. We're gonna have some farms over here. Uh, that looks like, whoa, looks like, uh, the Thebans are gonna attack. Which is, uh, which is not good. Fuck. Oh, motherfucker. Let's see if we get the cavalry after that guy. We might lose the tower, though. I think. No. Damn it. We're gonna rebuild that wall. Other fuckers. You bastards. Oh, no. 
Let's see if we can draw him away from the city. Damn, dude, this comes at Bowman. Shit. Why do I not have composite Bowman? They're so good. Screw you, catapults, you bastards. Wait, aren't you? Aren't those catapults supposed to, have, supposed to have minimum range? Why can they attack me that close? Little bastards. I need food. I think I might try and build a granary over here. But I need food before I can fund my army. The tower should keep the Thebans on my back for a while. Oh, all right, so we killed all the Thebans. This means that this artifact we should be able to take. I hope so. Oh, that's it? Holy shit, that's easy. <laughs> Alright. That's cool. Your intrepid defense has thus far parried the assaults of the feared Spartan Alliance. Deprived of their supply train, the Spartans grow discouraged as they watch ships bringing provisions into Athens each day. In frustration, they have turned to pillaging the nearby countryside while your citizens watch them from the safety of the high walls of their citadel. This jubilation is not to last, however. Word has finally reached Athens of the Spartan victory at Egos Potomai and the destruction of the Athenian fleet. Without a navy, it will not be long before your supply lines in turn are cut. Perhaps the Spartans will be willing to negotiate a peaceful settlement to the war. Cool. The Pel Well, that was fun. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to go ahead and take a quick break here. We'll probably be fighting some stuff, um, I guess in the next episode, right? I guess we're fighting against the Persians or we're fighting for the Persians or something like that. So I'm not sure. So, all right, guys, I will see you in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching as always. Please make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. I do hope you guys are excited about the return of Age of Empires. So I'll see you guys soon. Thanks so much.